Where are you? <laughs> hey. Oh. Time to go to school. Let's go. Peace. 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 Your face is so cute. Bye. Later, dudes. So, I just dropped the kids off at school, and then I was doing a three-point turn to get out of the cul-de-sac, little street, end of the street, whatever, and some fool backed into me, and he was pissed, but it was his fault, so that really sucked. But let me show you guys. Ryan came to my rescue, because that guy said he was gonna call the cops on me, and I was like, it's your fault, look at that. He backed into me. And he said, you didn't see me? And I'm like, I saw you back into me. That's what I saw. Good morning. Hey guys, it's been a while since I've weighed in, so I thought I'd show you that I'm up a little bit. Nothing to be ashamed of here. There's lots of reasons why we could be gaining or losing weight, whatever the case may be. I'm just gonna go off these pants. I love them because they're buttoned up. So these are size 14. There's no stretch at all to them. So I'm just gonna be trying these on like once a week to see how things go instead of just go off of the scale because that thing goes up and down, up and down, really depends on what I eat. And these pants look pretty good, but these are size 12. Like it's so frustrating with the sizing nowadays. These are a little bit stretchy. I like how they fit. I do not like the style of them, but I'm like, whatever. I can't dress myself. You look so handsome today. Really? Yes. Okay, so moving on to my first meal of the day, I'm just gonna take some of this chicken that I prepped, and if you guys didn't see my last meal prep video, you'll notice that I'm using a few things from my meal prep, which is why we meal prep, because it makes it easy. And of course I have to give Maddie some because she's always begging, but I'm like, chicken? Yeah, I'll give her some chicken. She's such a good girl, she deserves it. So with my chicken, I'm gonna pull out my mayonnaise, which I did make on my uh, meal prep video. I should have made double, I probably will next time. So I'm gonna do a serving of that, and that's all I have left. I definitely need to make some more. I'm just gonna add some yellow mustard. Nothing really going on in the ingredients there. And I'm gonna do a teaspoon, five grams of that. Mix it together with some liquid stevia and it makes like a honey mustard. I'm also gonna add some real salt. It makes like a honey mustard. I like to call it hunty mustard. So just in case you guys wanna make this, I call it hunty mustard and it's so delicious. Also from my meal prep, I'm gonna make these deviled eggs. And to fill it, I did the filling, divided it by however many eggs I made, 11 grams per half. So if I wanna be like totally precise, all I have to do is put this on my scale like I am right now, and then do around 11 grams per half of an egg. So it'll be like perfect macros if you guys are tracking and that sort of thing. So, just gonna get my deviled eggs ready and that's gonna do it for my first meal. Super easy, super convenient. Love fresh deviled eggs without having to make them every single time. So if you guys wanna check out how I did that, go ahead and watch my meal prep video. I'll link it down below and in a card up top here. But that was good, can you tell? Still wanting something and I made this jerky in my meal prep video. Again, meal prep comes in so handy and jerky is something that I love to keep around. I really need to get a new dehydrator with a lot of racks so I can make a bunch more beef jerky. But at the end of my beef jerky, I did want to slather on some butter because I always find mixing fat with protein is way more satiating. Otherwise, I could eat all my beef jerky in one sitting. And if you guys haven't tried butter on your beef jerky, you really need to try it. We are off to the jacuzzi, or the hot tub, whatever you want to call it. I got these uh, high-waisted bathing suit bottoms and they're too big, but they fit well mm. enough to go swimming. <laughs> let, let me look at the pages first. No surprise here, on to my second cup of coffee. I'm doing it the exact same way, but we're doing iced this time. What'd you say? You want coffee? Yeah. What did you say? I want coffee. You know. You're tripping, child. Wait. I want coffee. I'll just use the same damn cup as earlier. Real life, people. Uh, That's too much. No, it's not. <laughs> A little bit of this, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. That's healthy. Healthy salt. That's too much. Nope. It's just right. Delicious. Bring me to life. Bring me to life. I need ice. Okay, go ahead and write about your day, and then you can be done.
um my girl and my other girl and this cute boy do that again oh you're just too cute thank you goodness gracious Goodness gracious, goodness gracious. Yeah, I think maybe this is gonna take us a while anyways because we got mad Splinter's child. Oh my goodness. <sighs> what you doing? Snack? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Delish. There you go. That's the good spot. Mmm, good snack. Getting some of this done. Using some of our meal prep ground beef. I'm going to dig all that out and add it back to the pot. Okay, we got some Parmesan crisps on his salad. Taco salad. Avocado, sour cream, reduced sugar you ketchup. They all want a hard wait, boiled egg said, on the side. You said oh, no wait, sugar. it's sugar free, right? No sugar added ketchup. No, Some avocado that. for him, and he wanted the cheese crisps on his. And Aurora just wanted sour cream. Mine looks good. Yes, that's what the kids are having. Okay, now time for mom's food. I'm just gonna take whatever meat's left. I do have more if they want more. I could just reheat it again, which I think I ended up doing. Anyways, I'm gonna add some cheese to that, one ounce of cheese. This is the meal prep mozzarella cheese that I had already on hand, and an entire avocado with some Redmond's Real Salt. This salt is amazing. If you have pink salt, use that, or sea salt will work as well. You just wanna make sure you're using a good salt. Got some sour cream and some Valentina hot sauce, so delish, and a hard boiled egg with more salt all over it because that's how I like it. If you have lemon or lime, I'd squirt that all over this bad boy. Okay, so the night's winding down and I want to wind down too. So I'm just going to take some Earl Grey tea and just kind of go with this tonight. I do like this tea. I don't really have it that often, but I do like to switch it up every now and then. Normally I stick with black tea and coffee and like, you know, my passion tea or green tea sometimes, but I'm feeling like having something different and something hot. So I'm gonna go with this and you just steep for a couple minutes, no big deal. And yeah, that's gonna do it. You could add cream to this. I've heard of people doing that. I think it's called a London fog, not 100%, but I wanted a little bit sweet. So I just added a couple drops of stevia and I'm just gonna sip on this and that's it. It was good. Come here. Hey guys, that's gonna do it for my full day of eating today. I hope you guys liked it. After looking at my like nutrition breakdown, I think I'm gonna try to work on increasing my fats a little bit and lowering my protein just a little bit. Um, I was pretty um, satisfied today. Um, usually when I eat chicken, I'm not that satisfied, but I think I did okay adding the fats to it. As you could see in my macros, even though my calories are a little bit lower, I could probably cut down my protein a little bit, up my fat a little bit to like, you know, become more satiated, if that makes any sense. Um, because I do find a lot of times when I talk to people that when they do up their fat a little bit and knock their protein down a little bit, they're more satisfied with their food. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to give that a try. I didn't really um, pre-plan any of my meals. I did meal prep, but I didn't pre-plan any of my meals. Like if I was going to go into my fitness pal ahead of time and then put in all my macros for, for the day, that way like everything's perfect. I used to do that all the time. So I think I might try that uh, tomorrow or something like that. Maybe I could do that for you guys in the next video. But anyways, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. Bye. Later. Bye. Bye. Later. Bye. All right, guys. Bye. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.